taking a ferry across the way. Our guide is losing his damn mind. This monastery, Pagaya, was built in 1782. Hey, Lava. Look at all the bats up there. This entire monastery is made of teak wood and they use one tree, so some of the smaller are 30 years old all the way up to 60 years old. These things are beautiful. Yep. We're riding around on this island. It looks like an island and a uh, horse cart. And it's really pretty. Um, but if you have a bad back or anything, do not do it because you get jarred a lot. This is a watchtower built in the 1800s and it's kind of leading. <laughs> We just get to show our tickets that yeah. we bought at the National Palace, oh, and yeah. same, same. This has a very long name. Maha Ongjao Bom San Monastery. Say that three times fast, or one time slow. But, for short, the Brick Monastery, and it was built in 1822. Well, congratulations! Thank you. Wow. That wedding party came from Yangon, just to get pictures at this beautiful place. What did Yangon used to be called? I don't remember. What's that thing that you like at the Chinese restaurant that's Yangun? like that? Yep. of our tour. We are on our last part, which is sad, but it's the open bridge and why we're gonna build that. Amarapura Wooden Bridge. This bridge is 1.2 kilometers. It's made of teak and a thousand of these and it's 180 years old. We're off. What a beautiful wrap for the day. This is just icing on the cake. They're doing wedding pictures right down below the bridge where we're walking off. It looked really cool. Looked like flamenco, we decided. <laughs> this is called Malai. It's some milk product, kind of a yogurt cheese thing that's made in a village well outside of Mandalay. It's a delicacy. Reminds me of a dough that hasn't been cooked yet. It has a nutty flavor to it. It's actually really good. I like this one. This is the Zai Cho Market, one of the oldest in Mandalay. They really need these blankets because it gets down to 60 degrees at night, even though it's really hot during the day. About 90 degrees. first got here we saw all this wood and we thought it was firewood but it was so pretty and now we know it's for all of the paint on their face. Uh, we've seen tuk-tuks everywhere but apparently in Myanmar they've only been here for the last couple years and that's why they're all 
also new and shiny. This is the pagoda that we can see from our rooftop when we have dinner every night. Yeah, you take your shoes off every time you go into a pagoda. The Myanmar people are the most genuine, happy, and kindest people that we've met in our travels. You see people dancing and laughing, and I really haven't seen anybody fighting. It's, uh, it's a really beautiful, amazing place. Hotel Aurora in Mandalay is wonderful. It's in the middle of the city where your perfect location. Amazing staff and they have wonderful Wi-Fi. They said they're gonna change the uh, bed to make them softer and then it's a, t a 10. And they have a generator, so when the power goes out, you're still okay. If you like our video, leave the thumbs up and subscribe. No, no, that was good.